What's up, girly? Welcome back to my channel. I'm getting ready to head out and ship off these uh, boxes from my giveaway. They are really freaking big. I'm going to drop those off at the P.O. Box office place, and then I'm going to check in my P.O. Box, and then we'll do a quick P.O. Box haul. That's how we'll start off this vlog. If you're new here, my name is Michael. I'm 24. I'll turn 25 in July, but I love pink. I live alone. I'm in the midst of decluttering. I'm always, like, treating myself, and here soon, I do want to plan a trip. So, I feel like this year, I'm going through, like, a big change, just, like, I'm turning 25 this year. I want a lot of different things out of life. I kind of, like been on my own for a year now after being engaged so I've like I feel like I've learned a lot I usually like to judge how good is my day gonna go based off like my lashes and they're okay like I'm not hating them they're a little bit weird but I got my new Tiffany necklace on and we're gonna take my Louis bag like I cannot get over those still just put those in the car I forgot I have Goodwill bags so I might stop at Goodwill and do that first but now let's head on out and get right up onto the goodwill i just have two trash bags like two goodwill bags to drop off and then these boxes right here will go to the po post office and drop them off and i just had a really cute idea because my purse my louis vuitton purse comes with a little lock but um i don't use it because it comes with two little keys too and i guess i would just have to put them on my keychain and use it like that but how cute would it be if i made a charm bracelet and put those little locks on it i think it could work like that hang on Let's see, do I got time to pull them out? Oh, they're just like in my bag somewhere because I can't find them. Oh, here it is. See, I could put this just like on a keychain and then my purse would always be locked up. So if someone was to steal it, to open it, you would have to like damage it. Oh my gosh, there's a big old truck backing into the spot you're supposed to pull into right now. Like a big old Goodwill truck. What am I supposed to do? I'm just gonna pull up beside it and just round up my two bags. That's what I'm gonna do. I just got two bags, y'all. That's all. I'm just gonna go right here for just a second. All right, let's go see if they're cool with that. So weird. He was like, stop. He was like, don't walk right there. He like would not let me come any further. <laughs> Oh, my man, <laughs> reverse. All right, let's go to the post office. That was so awkward. This is insane. There is a, literally a cart full of stuff for me, but I got into a little altercation with a crazy bitch as I was about to go in. I want to tell you about that, but where can I put my camera? While oh, you see me just do this. Just watch me do this for a second, okay? That's all. I need to go take this cart back now and then I'll tell you the story about the crazy bitch. Let's head to Hobby Lobby so I can make a DIY charm bracelet and then I'm gonna tell you about the crazy bitch I just countered, like emphasis on crazy bitch. So it happened before I even pulled in here. But anyway, sorry if I got too much gloss on, I'm like spitting everywhere, I can feel that happening. <laughs> anyway, so before I pulled in, the, it was just like I, I needed to turn into the turning lane so I mean, there was nothing she was doing or I was doing. I just put on my turn signal and got over. And I could kind of tell as soon as I put on my turn signal that she started to speed up. Like, she didn't want me to pass her. But I had plenty of room and I passed her anyways. And she did not like that. She, like, threw up her hands like that. And then we both turned in there and we both parked. And so she was, like, two customers in front of me. And um, as soon as I, like, opened my door to get out, she was like, at least one of us can fucking uh, drive. And I was like, yeah, it's me. I used a turn signal to get over. And she didn't use one turn signal. She had to get over two. She didn't use a turn signal to get over or to turn into the um, post office. And so I was like, I'm the only one who knows how to drive here, if that's what you're saying. And so then she started saying some other stuff. I said, shut up, bitch. I was literally like, shut up, bitch. I could see her shaking. I mean, I was shaking, too, because I don't really have encounters like this. And then I was like in line right behind her and I like put my two big old packages for the giveaway down on the table and I stared her in the eye. I was like this close to her. I was like giving her a dirty face. She had brown eyes. Like I was so close to her. And um, 
that's when the workers were like, hey, oh my gosh, you have so many packages back here. Like, we'll get you the cart. We'll let you roll the cart out. Like, they were being so nice. I was just like, thank you so much. Like, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Meanwhile, this bitch, well, it's just crazy for no reason. You guys know I don't cuss often. So, like, I'm just telling the story how it is. But I'm already at the Hobby Lobby. I was really close to it. Um, I'm gonna start a TikTok just doing like a little, oh my gosh, girlies, I have this idea, make a charm bracelet. But that was just crazy to me because like I didn't do nothing wrong. I just got over in front of her and she did not like that. But I had plenty of room and I mean, maybe because she turned on planning, she planned on turning soon too. So she didn't want no one in front of her because she was about to turn, but I was about to turn in that same lane. That's why I even got over. I used a turn signal, she didn't. I had plenty of time like, and then once she was, um, talking with the person out there she sounded so distressed and like i could tell she was still shaking up and she was like yeah my mom just passed away and i was like girl like don't try to get sympathy from me because you were rude for no reason but we are at the hobby lobby now i gotta turn off my car or else my phone connects to it so i do that every time i go to do a TikTok. instead of waiting for my phone to disconnect it's just quicker to open the door shut it but this is the video i'm going by and I want to shout her out because it's, 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 it's only got 170 likes, but I thought this video was like the best, um, I almost took a screenshot on accident. I was trying to turn down the volume. It was the best in death of how to do it, and she made a really cute bracelet, so. Miss Carrie, I'm going to be following your video and doing it. Oh my goodness, girly, that took me about four trips to get all that in the house. We are going to, I'm so excited, I'm so excited to unbox all of this, so we're going to get right into it. I mean, we have to do that big one first, right? The really big one? Let's just do it. We're going to do the big one first. All right, let's see what it is, what it is. Now you can't even see my head. Oh my gosh, it's big, it's heavy, and it's wrapped. What the heck could this be? I need more room. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is heavy. What the heck am I holding? What is this? Hang on, let me turn you. Oh, I can't see nothing because of that chair. Okay, this is what I'm dealing with. I'm scared. I'm very, very scared. This is the body. Well, I wasn't kidding when I said, is this like a body? It's a body. What the heck am I looking at? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> is this like PR? Oh my God. <laughs> what is this? Ugh. Oh my gosh. What the heck am I gonna do with this? Look at her behind. <laughs> oh my gosh. It smells like a brand new hot pull item or something. What's going on with her boobs? Get them to pull out. Oh, there's makeup in here. This is Stella Stila, Stella Stila, something like that beauty. Oh my gosh, this is insane. What is this though, actually? Oh, it's a blush. Oh, this is huge. Oh my gosh, is it supposed to look like a... <laughs> I mean, I guess, because it was it came from in here. So, let's see, what's on the other side? Ugh. Girl, you're deflating. I think you need to call your doctor and tell him he didn't do a good job. You're deflating. This is so cool. Who invented this? Okay, drawers are a little bit janky. Drawers are a little bit hard to deal with, but... What is this, another blush? No, it's a sculpting powder. See what this looks like. Does it look like another? Oh yeah, it does. This is a bronzer. <laughs> I said, does this look like another? <laughs> yeah, it does. Oop, gotta be careful with that. All right, what's in her cooter? <laughs> I'm so sorry. What's in this part right here? It's a highlight. This whole thing for three items? Oh, <laughs> you're not gonna believe what this highlight looks like. Is this appropriate? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna show you for just a second. It's called Divine V. This is the highlight. <laughs> Gorgeous. Oh my god, it's shiny. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Why is this all like so sexual? That's crazy. Now, what am I supposed to do with this? Like, I don't... Do I have to just keep this? 
<laughs> She's thick. I gotta figure out what to do with this. That is insanity. She's going back there for now. And now we can put all the trash into this box. I cannot believe that's the first thing I opened. That makeup was insane. <laughs> oh. All right, we're gonna do a bag first. Let, let's do this one because it's got a little rip in it. I cannot believe these. These are <laughs> these are crazy. That was insanity. No offense, I love it all. Like, I love getting makeup. Like, I cannot wait to try and use this stuff. I'm sure it's so good. But what part of this was like, yes, let's send this to Michael Duvall XO. <laughs> oh, these are cute. Oh, okay, these are some socks. What is the Y3, YB? I don't know. It's giving, like, knockoff YSO or something. Oh, that's their brand. I'm ignorant. It's called U Boutique. You boutique, that's their brand. Look how luxury their little symbol looks. I like that they invented that for them. It looks like a it looks like a luxury symbol. This looks like a bag. A purse. Ooh. Ooh, hold up. <gasps> this is so gorgeous. We were just talking about how they looked luxurious and stuff. And look, this is the type of stuff they make. Look at this bag. This is so nice. This is actually like a fanny pack. You boutiques. New Orleans, New Orleans, you boutique, New Orleans. Make sure I got that all right. This is so cute. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I love that. And then these socks are so cute. I love the ones with the stripes. Like varsity giving is my favorite stuff ever. We'll do another package because they're easy to rip open. And I'm curious what's in this big old black package. I'm trying not to show the address. I'm curious, I'm curious. Let's just rip it open. Alright, we've got some clothes, it looks like. So, this stuff's brand new with, like, tags on it. Oh, this is cropped. Cropped little sweater. This is cute. I wonder if this is, like, their shop, you know? Let's look at the brand. It says, thank you for shopping. Shop. Shop Red Rage Boutique. Red Rage Boutique. That's what it's called. Red Rage Boutique. Put that there. Oh, are these matching pants? <gasps> they are matching pants. Oh, these look really, really comfy and cute. Hold up. This little set actually looks so cute. Thank you for sending me this. Let's see what else. There's a jacket in here, and then there's a card, too. Oh, look, it's a little vest. I've never worn anything like this, but it looks so cute, don't it? Put that over here to the side. Let's read this little note. My name is Jess McDaniel. Jess McDaniel, did I say that? Yeah, I said that right, right? Thank you so much for sending me that. That stuff is so cute. All right, we have another big box. I think we should save it till last, maybe, and get through all those first. This is from a LaToya Branch. Did I say that right? LaToya, Lato. I'm pretty sure I said that right. Right, right, right? She makes luxury press-on nails. Came in this really cute pink box. See that right there? Let's open it and let's see. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Oh, I think maybe she had reached out to me or someone reached out to me. I don't know. This is not what I remember. This is so cute. Oh, this is a little money clip grabber. So see at the bottom is for when your nails are too long. She sent these gorgeous, gorgeous nails I'm going to have to put on at some point. And then what is this little tool? This little bedazzled thing. I'm going to take it out because I don't know what it is. Oh, it kind of tore up the package a little bit. But what is this? Oh, is this an eyeliner? This is so cute. Okay, and then she sent me some lashes. She sent me um, a gloss, a cuticle oil. Yeah, lashes. Oh, those lashes have butterflies on the end. <gasps> I'm sorry, I'm like destroying everything trying to get it out. But if you can almost see, they have like butterflies on the tip. Those are so cute. Oh my god. <laughs> and then, let's see what this oil looks like. I mean, not the cuticle oil, this lip gloss. You know, I love lip glosses. And then I'll take everything out one at a time. Alright, look at how gorgeous her lip gloss is. This little packaging is so cute. And this is what it looks like. We'll go ahead and throw a little bit on. Ooh, that is so shiny. Mmm. It's like grape soda or something. That is so amazing. It's like grape Fanta. That's what it's reminding me of. It just smells so good. It's called Champagne. Ah, oh, that's so good, girl. Yeah, that's so cute. Thank you so much. Ooh, a bunch of wax melts. I love wax melts. 
Thank you so much for supporting our small business, Majestic Creations. This is from Majestic Creations. They sent me all these wax melts right here. So we got like, ooh, this is like a sparkly pink. It looks like very moist on the top. I don't know if that's just like from the ingredients. That's the only one that looks like that or if it's because it was open. But these two are not like that. This one's like mm, really cute. It smells really good. Glittery. And this one's got like pink on the bottom. But it's also glittery and smells really good. They all smell really good. I can't wait to use these. Oh, I just realized it says cashmere plum, pink sugar crystals. That was my favorite. And then shimmering snowflake. Thank you so much for those. I got another package right here. Look how cute this package is. Got little cats on it. It says peace. Oh, this is from the Jersey Witch. She's so sweet. So she just started her business. She said she literally doesn't even have cards or nothing, but she said she sent me what she could. So let's see what she sent me. Her name is Lori the Jersey Witch. That's like her business, I guess. So let's see what's in this right here. I see a little squishy dinosaur. Look how cute this little squishy dinosaur is. And then there's some um, stickers that I really like. You are pure magic. Oh, this is like a cute little card right here. And these are those things that you burn. You recognize these? You like burn these? They smell pretty good too. Let's see what else is in here. There is four little of these wrapped up things. So let's see what all she sent me. She wrapped these up real good. She wanted to make sure nothing happened to it. Cute little baggie. Open it. See what's in it. Oop dropping stuff oh my gosh she said she didn't send a lot or like she, she acted like she didn't send that much she was like I sent you what I could and this is already all in the first bag like so many things she said this cord is too ugly for me to wear but she thought that this would still be really cute for me to hang in somewhere anywhere she's a car or something it's a pink quartz see it I thought it was funny that she said that about the chain. Look at this a ring right here. This is really cute. Can you even see it? Let's see what she said about the ring. This is a moonstone ring. It's like the moonstone from um, the Vampire Diaries. I'm the freaking moonstone. You get it? You get it? Catherine said that. This is a raw, raw amethyst. Deep love, happiness. Humility, sincerity, and wealth. These are so cute. They're raw amethyst. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. I don't know why my first instinct was to smell them, but I want to put this in my little jewelry tray behind me real quick. This is a pink flower. A guide heart encourages the heart and compassion for life. This is so cool looking. Oh my gosh, so look, I like this side because it's got like the little kind of holes in it right here. Look how cool this thing is. Let me know if you know stuff about this stuff, but this is so cute. I'm definitely going to treasure this. Pearls look great on you. That's what she said. Oh, this is cute. You know what? This does look great on me. I like this. Pink Zebra Jasp. So this is going to be a pink Zebra Jasper. It has calming effects and decreases anxiety. Promotes relaxation. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Thank you so much for all these crystals. I love these. I'm going to be decorating like my glam room. I might put some of these in my bedroom. These are so pretty. Look how pretty these are. <gasps> little stones in a jar. Oh my gosh. I love little crystals. You're about to get me into a crystal era. This is so much fun. And this is going to be a pink sapphire tower. It raises courage, drive, focus, helps you believe in yourself. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, this is also pretty. Thank you so much for all these crystals. I'm going to go put these in my bedroom or something here in just a minute. I need to put them in a very good spot where I can see them all the time. I love those crystals. Let's get another package. Four packages here, and then we have that other big one. So five in total. We are going to start on top and work our way down. Keep these in my lap. Let's see. Let's try not to drop everything. Ugh. What could this be? What could this be? Oh, someone sent me the Barbie mug from Walmart. Oh my gosh. Not just a Barbie mug from Walmart. Look how cute this is. I've never seen this one before in my Barbie era. I feel like that's like an online only. Like I've never seen that in person. Is there like a thank you card or like a name? 
Oh yeah, here's a thank you card. Aw. This cup is hand wash only. So sorry it took so long to get her in your hands. That's okay. Oh, is this just a Walmart box? Not from Walmart? Did you make this? She's been sold out. Great issue to have. I promise it was worth the wait. Thank you so much for sharing your life. I'm so excited for you to have her and to appreciate her. So this is from Savannah at The Typical Things. Oh yeah, this is from The Typical Things on Etsy. So this is just like a Walmart box. A Walmart box. So this is from her Etsy shop. No wonder why it was so freaking cute. <gasps> oh my gosh, yeah, this is adorable. I freaking love this cup. Let's see what is in this box. Let's open the card first. Oh, it says when this finally reaches you, I hope you put it in the glam room. And look at this card with the castle on it. So mysterious. I like it. Let's see what this is. It's the right shoe. Like, this is so cute. I feel like I should already know what it is, but I don't. I feel sad taking off the ribbon. Just the right style. Oh my gosh, look at this. <gasps> it's like a little shoe decor. Just the right shoe. Now I see why you said put it in the glam room, because this is giving glam room. I will. I'll display this here in a really cute spot with all my other stuff. That is so cute. I love how thoughtful a lot of these items have been, especially because you guys know I'm going through like a declutter, so just these thoughtful items are like really nice. All right, we got two more boxes in my lap. Two more boxes in my lap. How do I open that? Two more boxes in my lap. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I definitely didn't open this the right way, but I couldn't figure it out. This is from, their IG is my at Kindrum. I'm really bad at reading it. I think their name is Tata. Is that it? T-A-T-A. -T -A. It looks so cute. Your little autograph and handwriting and everything. I love it. But let's see the items. That note was so sweet. Ooh, what is this? Is this a pajama like PJ set? It's like Barbie the movie. And I might have messed up a little bit with the way I took it out. But this is a pajama set. Oh my gosh, it is. It is. You know, I love pajama sets. I live in pajama sets. Here's a long sleeve Barbie movie top. And I'm guessing that these are pants that match. Look how cute this stuff is. Thank you so much for that little set. There's also this Barbie bag. And it looks like there's stuff in it. So let's go through it. There's this Barbie bag right here. Where'd you find all these items? I've never seen this before. Premark? I don't know what that is. Oh my gosh, there's so much in here. <gasps> are these band-aids? These are so cute. Barbie band-aids. These are the cutest ever. Tell me why I need band-aids. On oh, Barbie keychain. I love this. I'm going to go ahead and take all the stuff out so I can just like deal with the trash as I go. Oh, is this mini sew? Is that the store you went to? I don't have that near me. Look how cute this is. Mini sew tried to like reach out to me a long time ago and they were like, um, come visit our stores. We'll give you money. And I was like, I don't live anywhere near one. But they said they were going to send me stuff. I don't remember. Yeah, I think they did a long time ago. They sent me like some Sailor Moon stuff. This is so cute. Barbie movie notebook. I love this. Look how cute that is. Ooh. Some more keychains. These are like shiny. These are so cute. Thank you for picking out all these items for me. Especially because that store's not near me. I love it. Thank you so much for this. This might be one of my new favorite little baggies to be honest. Now I got one more package and then we got that big one over here. All right, inside this box is a smaller box. This is from Hannah in South Carolina. She says, hope you love it. I hope I love it too, I'm excited. Oh, she commented before or like said something to me. I remember this, she sent me, you put them in your fridge and you can organize your drinks. I gotta figure out how to use this and set it up, but it's just like this white set of drink organizers. It's so cool. This one last box. This one last box is pretty heavy. Can't even cut straight. Oh my gosh, it looks like it's full of stuff. Full of stuff it is. She said, hey, I just wanted to send you a little gift. Say thank you for putting out your videos. She said, if you don't like them, go ahead, do whatever you want with them. I got a little candy carried away. Got a little carried away. Not candy carried away, just a little carried away. Let's see, these are really cute, these little lolly lollipop swirls. I gotta find a way to display these in my kitchen because they're cute, cute, cute. Oh my gosh, someone else recently sent me these and I didn't even know what they were. They're ornaments, but now I have like more. So I really can find something cute to do with those. Oh my gosh, there's different shades. Look at these ones. Oh, 
Oh, a Barbie movie princess collection. I love this. This is so sweet. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, you sent me everything. What is this? Barbie candy collection. This is kind of cool. You see it? Ooh, this is really pretty. A little castle ornament. Oh, I had this one. Remember I bought it? Oh my gosh, remember my vlog? I broke it. I dropped it and the strap broke. So I have a replacement now. Another Christmas ornament. This one lights up. I think I'm a little bit late picking up this package because of all the Christmas ornaments, but that's okay. I can save it for next year. I got Christmas vibes only. Oh, this cup is so cute. I can't wait to use that next year. Is this for candy? What is this? Pink hot chocolate. I never seen that in my life. Just add water and watch it magically change colors. I cannot wait to try that. All pink marshmallows. These look really cute. I'm gonna be snacking on these later. Oh, I love rock candy. Ooh, pink lemonade. I'm excited to try these. We got some heart cookie cutters. You see some heart. Ooh, and a kitty cat. I like the cat. Oh my gosh, a pink gingerbread house. What the heck? Oh, that's the second time my camera has turned off. I think it's overheating, but gingerbread house? You guys, should I do that this vlog or next vlog? Cause like, I gotta do it before it expires, right? Oh, the Barbie blanket. Did I buy this one? I think I have this one. Yeah, I think I have this one. Should I save this for a giveaway or something? Cause I totally already have this. Oh my gosh. It is a build your own cookie Barbie camper. This would be such a fun video idea. <gasps> what the heck? Stop, that is so cute. That might be like one of the most fun things I've seen. Oh, look at this little scraper, a little Christmas scraper. That's cute. Oh my gosh, a Barbie dream house cookie set. Where do you find this stuff? This is freaking awesome. Ooh, a pink lighter it says. What's it look like? Oh my God, this is what it looks like. It's a pink, just glittery lighter. This is so cute. I don't have a lighter like this. Oh my gosh, it's like a torch. Oh, look, it turns pink. It's a pink flame. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Yeah, that was so much fun. That last box was like a bestie box I'd be doing with my online friends. You don't want to see this mess behind me right now. Let me see. I'm about to shut this mirror behind me. And let's see, can you see the mess? Do you see it? Do you see it? Oh my gosh, you can kind of see it. It's kind of, it's like taken over. All these items are so cute. It looks so pink in front of me and I literally love that. Thank you so much for everything and I love when you guys think about me. You guys are just so considerate and so sweet. Most of Grilly, I just got some KFC. That's my dinner for tonight. I door dashed it because I did not feel like cooking. Let me show you what I got. I got a spicy chicken sandwich. This is what it looks like. Is this right? I don't know what the heck that is on it. This is like not right though. Cause this is two tenders. This is not what I ordered with something white on it. So maybe you're familiar with that. Cause I'm not, that's definitely not what I ordered. I'm probably gonna eat it, but like, let me go check. That already instantly like threw off the mood. What the heck? View receipt, I ordered a spicy chicken sandwich that comes with like pickles and stuff. This is like not a spicy chicken sandwich. Like should I say something about that? Like just one thing wrong? I'm not sure that's the only thing wrong. And I got large mac and cheese and biscuits. So everything else is right. Incorrect item. We've noticed you've been having some issues with your orders. What? Girl, I haven't been having that many issues. Continue. My spicy chicken sandwich. This ain't a spicy chicken sandwich. And like no hate to him. It's just uh, ingredient is missing or incorrect. Didn't receive this item. Wrong size was received or received wrong quantity. I ordered a spicy chicken sandwich and got a sandwich with two tenders and some weird looking white sauce. Yep, photos, photos. Since they wanna say my account's being shady, like no, if I say something's wrong, it's because it's wrong, like. It's supposed to have pickles on it too. Oh, my camera's dying. So it's just ingredient was missing and correct. That's it, that's all. I'm not sure what that white sauce is. No hate to that guy, like I would raise his tip. I was gonna say if I could, pretty sure I can. <laughs> They're gonna give me a dollar seventy nine. The sandwich costs more than that. 
Like, I wish there was a third option, because it says available to use immediate credits or a dollar seventy nine to my thing. A dollar seventy nine. You got the whole fucking thing wrong. Like, that's not the sandwich. Like, if I went up to the store with my receipt, they would give me the sandwich, but I don't want to do that. No, my issue was not resolved. I gave them a thumbs down and said I'm very dissatisfied. I said the support policies didn't meet my needs. I got refunded a dollar when the sandwich is completely wrong and I paid more than a dollar for it. It's the principle. <laughs> like, it's literally principle. That, mmm. Makes me so mad. Cause like literally what is that white sauce? What is that? It's just, I wouldn't even be mad if it was just two tenders. If that was the thing, if it was the two tenders and spicy sauce and a pickle. I don't know what that is. It almost just tastes like cheese. I have no clue. This is so trippy trying to figure out what this sauce is. They have like a bacon ranch, a creamy ranch. It's not ranch. It tastes cheesy. I don't know what the heck that is, but that does not make me happy. They also did give me a fork, so now let me go get one of my own. So gross and wrong of them to only refund like a dollar or something. Sandwich itself, you know it's like three or four. My camera's about to die. I don't even know how I'm going to eat this or if I'm going to eat it. I was so excited in the first half. I'm gonna try to eat some of it, but the big wops in the middle, like, I'm about to wipe it off with a paper towel. Just left my hair cut. Sorry, I didn't really show you the before, but there's the after. I think it looks pretty good. I'm actually going to head to Marshall's real quick just because I'm not ready to go home yet. There's not really much traffic right now, and I'm like one minute away from it. It's like right by the mall. So I'm just gonna head to Marshall's, do a little vlog going there, and we'll see what I do today. I really don't know. I hope that my deck's getting painted right now. It should be getting painted today. Oh, is this the way I go? I think this is the way I go. I think my deck, ooh, that scared me. I don't like the way that car's coming in there. <gasps> Sorry, uh, I think my deck's getting painted right now. I really hope so. Ooh, I wanna show you this sign. So this is the mall, like one of my favorite malls locally, St. Matthew's. Thought that was cool, just to let you see the little sign. But how do I get there from here? I really don't know. I'm following the GPS and this don't make a whole lot of sense to me, but. Oh, there's a Hilton Garden Inn. How co is that like Hilton, like Paris Hilton? But um, how come Paris Hilton doesn't let me have like a free hotel so I can do my vacation, like my trip? That'd be cool. <laughs> Paris, if you're seeing this, which I know you're not, but she does see my TikToks, let me have a free hotel in a fun state so I can travel. In a luxury suite. Just left Marshalls, we're gonna do a quick little haul before I head home. I was trying not to buy too much, but of course I found like a lot of pretty cute stuff because I haven't been in a while. So this is one of the first things I got. It's a Juicy Couture Diffuser. I've had one of these before and they're amazing. Floral Fantasies, I think is one of my favorite scented candles that they have. So that's awesome. A car just pulled up right in front of me. I also got this a Cube Dazzle Tongue Scraper. There was like a blue one. I've always wanted a tongue scraper, but this one was bedazzled, so I had to get it. This girl gets to see the whole haul. Oh, she's got a kid. So I also got this pink lock. This is actually from my shed because I felt comfortable saying it now because by the time I post this, I'll have a lock on it, but my shed did not have a lock on it before. And then I got this kitty cat lip balm, which is super cute. That was like only $5. I'll tell you the prices of everything else. But let me show you this mug that I got. This mug is a Naruto X Hello Kitty mug. So I just had to get it. Like I can see this being the mug I use all the time. Remember, I'm trying to do better on not spending so much. So that's everything I got. That mug was like $6. This is $10. This tongue scraper was $8. It's kind of pricey, but tongue scraper can help your breath. Um, the chapstick was $5 and the lock was only $6. So I spent like $37, not too shabby. I definitely held back. There was a lot of other cute stuff. 
I found the Hello Kitty in Barbie yoga mat. And that makes me so mad because I already bought a plain pink yoga mat off of Amazon. I did not think I would find those near me or else I would have held out. But let's get the directions home. And let's go home. I am getting some McDonald's real quick. This is going to be my first time rolling my windows down. I got my windows tinted a week ago today. And he said wait seven days. So I, I hope I'm good. Pray for me. I'm scared. Oh my gosh, I just wrote it down for the first time in a week. Can I get a 20 piece chicken nugget? Okay. With barbecue sauce and a small fry and then a large sweet tea. Anything else I can get for you? No, that's it. First I'm gonna do apple pie. Thanks, you too. He didn't even offer me my receipt, but that's okay because I don't want it anyways. As long as the food's right. You can't really mess up 20 nuggets and a fry, can you? You could, I guess. <laughs> I guess you could. I haven't been to McDonald's in forever. Like, this is like a month since I've been here. Thank you. Thank you. She was really nice. She had a smile on her face, which I always appreciate. Oh, look. My window's not messed up. <laughs> it's like it's a miracle. Okay. It's not a miracle. He said wait seven days. It's been seven days. Like on the dot. I just finished posting my last YouTube video. I love responding to the early comments. That's what I was just doing. But I also made these cookies while I was editing. So I just wanted to show you them real fast. They were like the Valentine's Day cookies. These types of cookies are always like pretty dry. But they're good with milk. What's up girly? I just woke up. So this is my two pink chairs and my table. It's a little bit bigger than I expected. And apparently I have to assemble it. I thought that it would have been like a little bit assembled or whatever. I literally just woke up and that thing was so heavy to even bring in here. I look busted right now. That's why I'm just showing the this side of the camera, not this side. I guess I'll wake up, build this, show you what it looks like. The deck got started yesterday, but he didn't do the floor. He has to go get another color for the floor, but he did all of that. So all that is like freshly white again. You can even see like white on the deck, but I'm sure he was gonna go over that. Just got done with the patio set, so look how cute it is. He also just got done painting it, but I can't really go out there yet because it's still drying. He said in a couple hours it should be dry, so I should be able to put this out there tonight. But it's so big, so nice. This was like right under $200 on Amazon. And I just like it. So let's go and let's sit for a second. Oh wait, let's sit in this chair. Now I'll put the camera behind me, like on me. So we're just chilling, you know, on the patio. Uh, really, they're just gonna be dropping off my DoorDash right here. I also scheduled my first consultation for a laser hair removal on my face. It's on Monday. So hopefully soon I don't gotta be shaving my face like every three days. I just hate it. I've never wanted facial hair and I know that's never gonna change so I want laser on my face. I'm also waking up every morning like really wanting to go to Hilton Head or just like I just want to relax. I just need to get away. I'm gonna like change my life while I'm out there and I'm just really looking forward to that so hype me up for it. Hype me up for it. Are you ready to see my deck? It looks pretty good. I mean I'm not gonna give it like a 10 out of 10. But it looks good. I also got my stuff on there, so let me show you. This is what it looks like. Focus. Pretty cute, right? And then I'll put the other chair over here since it didn't fit over there. I think it looks nice. And then it's painted, so definitely looks fresher than before. But yeah, that's gonna be really nice whenever they go to drop off my DoorDash and it's finally on a nice table and a newly painted deck. I'm about to end this YouTube video just because I wanna go ahead and edit and post it, start anew, because I know that those P.O. boxes, the P.O. box hauls, they eat up. They eat up a long video, but that's always good. Long videos are always fun. I don't even remember what all we did in this haul, but I think we did a lot of fun stuff. So thank you so much for sticking with me, and I hope you like and comment. Leave a comment I can respond to. I'm always responding to like the really early commenters. Please subscribe. Make sure you subscribe, because my goal is to hit 100K before the summer. That's a goal that I think we can do. And please turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss my videos, and you can continue to support me. I love you so, so much. Until the next vlog, bye, girly.